could Douglas Bullet be the man marked by flames? Who knows? He does have a burn mark on the left side of his body, but in adding him to the story would make him canon, of course, because he was just in a Stampede movie and Stampede was considered non-canon. But if he's considered canon, would that hurt anybody? All you gotta do is just change his backstory, keep Douglas Bullet the same, overpowering strong motherfucker that he is, keep him with some Conquerors hockey, and probably change his devil fruit because it's too much like kids. I mean, you can. You can keep it the same shit, but oh, you know, yeah, he's going to be a problem for Kit, though. Oh, yeah. Are they going to see Kit and him get down? Oh, yeah, that'd be good, actually. So, yeah, let's just put Douglas Willard in the story now. Because who else could be the man marked by flames? There's one that's screaming to me is Aokiji, of course. But why would Aokiji have enough information about the One Piece? Douglas Blood is the one that was on Roger's ship. Who knows? We might keep that with his backstory. Huh? We don't know. We don't know. We just got to wait and see. He might just be a part of the story.